All right, hello everyone. I think YouTube censored one of my YouTube videos because I posted a video where I had scheduled a video on my channel that was basically titled like, I think someone's doing witchcraft on me. And the video, like I don't even see it on my page. I can't see it where it was even scheduled anymore. I'm like, either someone saw it and reported it, I don't know, but I don't have like any notification of the video being deleted or the video being against YouTube um, policies or whatever. So it just literally like disappeared off my channel. I don't see it on there at all anymore. So I really don't know what happened except for I just don't have the video on there anymore. So, um, that's kind of suspicious in my opinion, but I guess it's whatever. Anyways, um, I wanted to, I feel like I made a video like this. I pretty much just want to explain why I am not a feminist, why I don't consider myself a feminist. And I really think it just comes down to my mindset at the end of the day. I feel like feminism, um, the feminist movement, and this comes from like my actual experience because I took a women's studies class, which is basically just all about feminism, why you need feminism. But essentially, I feel like the feminist movement pretty much just encourages victim mentality and hating men in a lot of ways. Like, um, especially like modern day feminism for sure, which is what I'm referring to. Like, obviously, I wasn't around during the 20s. Or whatever or whenever the original feminist movement took place I mean I understand women's suffrage and women fighting for the right to vote and all of that stuff which it's like we have the right to vote right like the bigger the biggest issues I guess that we're facing women were mainly just um and I don't know to me again I feel like it just really comes down to I don't view myself as a victim um, of the patriarchy and that's the other thing like a lot of feminist feminism is rooted around you know the belief that patriarchy controls and rules the world and that this idea that you know um, The patriarchy basically controls everything and I feel like huh, it's just a lot of things you have to not necessarily jump through hoops but it's just a lot of things I feel like it's just blaming it's just blaming men for like all of your problems as a woman essentially is what I feel like modern feminism sounds like but I don't actually believe I'm a victim. I don't believe I'm less than because I'm a woman. And I also don't think there's anything like I'm limited in what I can and cannot do. I feel like the truly the only thing that limits people is their mindset. Like if you think you're not capable of doing something, that's the only thing that stops you. Anyone who was actually determined to do something in this world was able to do it. If you are willing hard enough to, were willing to work hard enough to achieve that thing, it's just like no one can actually stop you from doing anything but you. Um, and I also feel like a lot of the women's rights movements 
or feminist movements it all just is built on like needing someone else to do something for you or you know we have to like men need to do this and men need to do that and everything which I think at the end of the day like I definitely is not me saying I'm not a feminist doesn't mean that I don't think that um women are not valuable or necessary but I feel like I believe that and I don't need feminism to believe that women hold value and can do certain things in this world I think a lot of it just boils down to you know I what I see from a lot of feminists is just a victim mentality of blaming all their problems are men oh the reason I can't do this is because the patriarchy oh the reason I can't do this is because men don't let women do things and it's just like I don't know it's just to me again that mindset just creates victim mentality and hating men for everything and I per personally don't blame men for all of my problems like a man is not responsible for all of my the problems I have as a woman now can I say that I don't agree with some things um men do yeah but that's not like every single man on the planet I don't know I really just think it comes down to the things that the feminist movement I also think sorry the things that the current feminist movement fights for too are not things that I necessarily agree with or support um and also doing like some research I feel like a lot of statistics are very very skewed as far as I remember someone said like when they're talking about like how much comparing how much men and women make they don't take account for like are they doing the same jobs now I definitely think you know any type of wage disparities and things like that for sure they can be present but you there's literally what, what's that um, law that exists? I mean, the amendment, uh, uh, there's a whole law basically against discrimination based on gender, based on sex, based on race, ethnicity, abil disability. You know, there's laws literally that don't allow for those types of things. So if you can prove that you're being treated less than or you're being discriminated against because you're a woman, that's a whole lawsuit that you could easily win. So again, it's just like a lot of the problem, there's not, it, it's like discrimination is not even allowed based off of all of those things. And if you can prove discrimination, if you can prove you're not being treated fairly or you're, you know, like I said, if you can prove those things, you have a court case and you should, the law is in your favor if you're being discriminated against. So I'm saying like the issue is not that we just allow women to be treated less than, it's really just you're seeking for, to make your, to make yourself, it's like you have to, you have to believe that you're less than as a woman in order to agree with feminism and because I don't believe or I'm not um focused on you know seeing women as being less than I don't feel the I don't know I just don't have the same mentality around femi feminism now if you asked me this same question like 10 years ago when i was in um what you might call it college i probably would have said differently i'd be like oh yeah for sure but i don't know i just feel like the older i get the more mature i get i think about things differently i see things differently and I just don't see the same issues with some of the problems as, you know, 
my younger self probably would have. And I just don't, I'm not more readily, readily able to believe, you know, everything happening, happening is just a result of the patriarchy and everything else. Um, you know, it's just, I've learned not to, not to, um, base all of my opinions on just, you know, wanting to find a problem or viewing myself as less than a, another person. Because the same thing can be said about, like, racism, too. Like, racism and sexism, I guess, are both isms based off of so social, you know, issues that some people um, face. But they're not always issues that are present unless you're maybe viewing the world through that that frame so if you think everyone's racist if you think everyone's sexist if you think all men are trash if you think like so lowly of all people around you then you do get that you know that bias it creates a bias against like racism there's black people who use racism as an excuse to hate white people and there's women who use feminism as an excuse or sexism as an excuse to hate men and it's just like if you view the world through the lens of you know I'm less than or I'm a victim because of whatever traits you have as a person it's just like you're always you can always find a problem if you're seeking one but I don't know I don't want to have that mindset and I don't think it's a healthy framework now by all means am I saying that if there's an actual issue that it's okay for anyone to be treated less than because of those things of course not I'm saying that there's no laws that allow that type any type of discrimination so if you are if you do feel like or you are in a situation where that's happening you have legal rights and protections in place for those things so it's like no there's no discrimination really allowed at the end of the day so that's all i'm gonna say